Firstly, a lot of innovations present themselves as smart technology ideas. Um, actually, the most powerful way of presenting uh, um, smart ideas is as a solution to a problem that we have in the NHS. Um, and that solution orientation is a really important way of building a narrative uh, and a business story around why this idea makes sense. Secondly, um, many ideas present themselves as just digital channel ideas. Whereas in the NHS, um, we know that what starts in a digital channel cannot always be completed in a digital channel. It will eventually flip to a physical channel, to a GP, to an acute, to a carer. And I think uh, a lot of medtech companies don't explain very well what, how their digital solution fits into a multi-channel solution and what will happen to the data or the activity or the transaction that starts in the digital channel. That's really important because in the end, um, many of the tech ideas that we see are great solutions within a very defined setting. And actually the NHS is a very complex setting. Thirdly, to that point, um, I think how MedTech explains the idea in terms of where it fits in our organizational structure, how it fits into a care pathway, how it fits into an STP, how it fits into an integrated care solution. This is like the receiving ground for innovation, um, but it has, it, it's a receiving ground which is itself an organizational structure. And uh, that, I think, breaking the back of how the, how the idea is explained in its organizational locus is a third key area that's really important. Uh, fourthly, around interoperability and security. How does it meet some of the standards that we're required to meet and make great sense in terms of creating a, a future interoperable dimension to many of the platforms that we're building and how they meet our security requirements, in, particularly in terms of cyber security. So that fourth area is key. And then finally, um, where it's relevant, how the idea uh, fits in with GDPR requirements too. So a lot of the innovations that I see uh, in the UK and here um, would, do, uh, would do really well if from a business and a solution perspective um, a bit more care is given to how it's going to be used and how it's going to be bought and how it's going to be established within an organizational structure. That would be my recommendation.